Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to reboot your Windows 8 in safe mode. Sometimes we need to reboot our machine in safe mode for some troubleshooting or some bug fixing. Microsoft has added some easy procedure in Windows 8 to reboot your, your machine in safe mode. So let's see how it works. First of all, you need to go to the power options. Here. And you need to click on the restart button. But keep in mind, while you click on restart, you need to keep your shift key pressed. This one is the shift key. So I will keep it pressed and click on reboot. So it will ask me to wait for a while and then it will show me some options. Okay, so here are the options we have available on this screen. Out of these options, we need to go to the troubleshoot and next advanced settings, and then we need to click on the startup settings. On in the startup settings, these options are available to us when we reboot the machine. We don't need to press any other key here and just click on restart. And the machine is rebooting now. Okay, so now the operating system is given us the option to select from the available menu. Here I will go for number 5. To select the menu on number 5, we need to press the 5 number on the keyboard. This one here. So now the machine will reboot in safe mode with networking. We need safe mode in Windows to do some troubleshooting or bug fixing. So it is helpful. In this mode, most of the options of the operating system are disabled and only some limited options available. This is helpful when we are fixing some, let's say, some bugs or some other issues. So the machine is now rebooted. I need to enter my password here for Windows. I need to go into the password field. It's now logging in. close the help menu for now so the machine is now rebooted in safe mode you can see all the all and the icons on the desktop are bigger than the normal this is what happens in the safe mode and how to identify the safe mode other than the bigger icons you can see on all corners of the screen it says safe mode so when you're done the fixing that you have come to a safe mode for just go to the power options and 
restart your machine without pressing the shift key and it will reboot normally with all the options enabled and in a regular mode so that's all for today thank you for watching